Welcome to the Broward Bulletin's webcast for Tuesday, June 29, 2010. I'm Candace Cooksey Fulton, staff writer for the Bulletin, and here are some of the top stories we'll have in our Tuesday paper. The 15-year-old suspect accused of robbing the Brownwood City Bank in January has been certified to go on trial as an adult. The youth has also been accused of engaging in organized criminal activity. Officials said more arrests may be made in the case. An investigation is continuing in the death of Deatrice Tolliver, 50, whose decomposing body was found near the residence of a, the Bangs man she was hired to take care of. Though there is no evidence of foul play, sheriff's deputies said there are suspicious circumstances. Ricky Kite, longtime employee of Smith Roofing Company, died Sunday after a fall he sustained doing roofing work on a building on Center Avenue Friday. On Monday, Brown County Commissioners approved almost $620,000 in budget amendments on an amount much larger than usual, but according to County Auditor Nina Cox, about half the amount is for jail roof repairs and the remaining is for property insurance proceeds. However, since as commissioners were meeting, the county was under a flood watch, the court did not approve a burn ban. You'll get all these stories and more in our Tuesday edition of the Brownwood Bulletin. Buy the paper at your local newsstand or find us here at brownwoodbulletin.com.